Ah, oh, good morning. Good morning. Sorry, how long were you awake for? That was a... That was a really well-deserved sleep, I think. I had a bizarre dream. I had a bizarre dream that when I went to go for my trip, my um, my trip tomorrow, <laughs> I sort of said goodbye to you at the airport, and then when I landed, you were you had somehow gotten there before me, but you looked different. You were like, I don't know, it was weird. You know how in a dream when you see someone they tend not to be, they tend not to look entirely accurate. You see their face, but then even if they didn't look like themselves, you would just sort of know who they were. I don't know. How about you? Did you sleep okay? You did? It's really nice to know. It's really, really nice to know. I know it can be, um, sort of challenging, uh, sharing a bed with someone sometimes, but I don't know. I feel like you and me, we, it's like I said last time, we sort of fit together like a pair of puzzle pieces, you know? I really enjoyed the way that, I think it was your idea, I just sort of, I laid back and you had your, your head on my chest and you lay down by my side with one leg in between both of mine and um, I just sort of stroked your hair until we fell asleep. It was nice. It was nice. <sighs> Very happy to have you. Very happy to have you indeed. I think about how fortuitous it was that we met, you know? If I hadn't have been brave enough, then this might never have happened. <laughs> but I'm glad it did. I'm very glad it did. So. What would you like to do today? I... Well... I, we both know I'm going away tomorrow. I'm gonna be gone for a week. And... Obviously, I'm going to miss you a tremendous amount. So I figured we could, um... Spend the whole day just... Just you and me. I need to have a... I want to have another experience to remember you by before I go. Does that sound okay? Thank you. 
You look beautiful in the sunshine as well. It suits you. It really does. Hmm. Just, I just need to hold you for a little while. I never could have imagined that sticking my neck out and trying to just keep you safe for one evening with no promise of anything in return would lead to something quite this incredible. Oh yes, yes, yes. Today we'll be on a date all day, just you and me. You and me, sweetheart, don't worry. Don't worry. The covers are so soft with you. will go by and you'll see me again. I have to go, okay? And I do love you, but I need to go. I'm sorry. But I know you'll be waiting for me when I get back, okay? Hmm. day and to say thank you for your patience when I when I head off um, I think I'd like to make you something yes good excellent all right well I'll get up in a sec and you can just follow me to the kitchen whenever you're ready okay babe craving it uh, all of yesterday, so, you know, even if you don't, uh, no, there's not a lot you can really do to dissuade me from this, this is just kind of what I want. <laughs> I'll get you some tea in a second as well. <sighs> do you have any strange dreams? You know, like the one I had? Anything that might bear worth mentioning? Extra paprika. Oh, interesting. Okay, okay, okay. Should have remembered. Should remember what it was that you preferred. Okay, no, that's fine. I can do that. Hmm.
peppers. Perhaps I can throw a few of those in. Perhaps. <laughs> you do have quite a strange sense of taste. And there you go asking me about pilk again. Whatever that is. No, this will be tea made with just milk. Just milk. Okay. There's your tea, babe. It's okay. Sorry if that sounds a little surprising. There we go. That's some bacon and eggs with a nice cup of tea on the side. So, when we have our breakfast, why don't you sit with me and let's plan our day, shall we? Just think about what it is we want to do together. Oh, you're welcome. Hey, there's no need to, there's no need to beg for it or anything. It's it's the least I can do. It's the least I can do. I was thinking that perhaps. Really? Oh, good, good, good. I'm glad you think I'm a good cook. <laughs> It's one of the one of the few things I think I can definitely pride myself on. I know that above all else, I'm probably a pretty good cook. <laughs> Shopping would be good. I'm thinking, why don't we so there's a night market in town today. So why don't you and I will take a fairly long walk into town? Stop by at the park have a rest there, and just sort of relax for a while, and then, when we get a chance, we'll... <sighs> what do we do? Head into town and uh, browse the stalls, and uh, see if we can't find some good food, and then, later on tonight, maybe we can uh, have a little bit to drink, and mm, see, see if anything fun happens, and... Uh, I think that sounds like it might be a bit of fun. Do you like that idea? Okay, good. Good, 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 good. Hmm. I should have a sip of my tea. Crazy week, hasn't it? You know, in almost no time at all, you and I really, really got off on the right foot, and it's. I think it's felt like it's been every day that we've been hanging out. really sweet to me, you know? And I think normally I don't think I'd have as easy of a time as I do uh, opening up to you, you know? Um, you... I'm trying to put this delicately. I 
just feel very special because you give me the privilege of being vulnerable sometimes, and I need that. I really do. Definitely more of a sensitive person than you might be used to, but you took to that in a really, really sweet way, and I'm very appreciative of that. Very appreciative indeed. Oh no, I'm okay. Hey, 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 hey. Shh. Oh, come here, don't worry about it, baby, it's okay. I'm not going away forever, I'm just going to be gone for a week. Don't worry about it, baby, it's okay. Thank you. Glad you appreciate it. Very glad. Yes. Be good while you wait for me, okay? I know you can... You're liable to get yourselves into trouble sometimes, what with all of these peculiar characters that keep following you around, and the way that you seem to always, always wind up finding your way in trouble. Whether it was that doctor, or whether it was that police officer, or different, you've always got a... some kind of an interesting... well... Some kind of an... You've got a knack for getting yourself into danger. But that doesn't change the way I feel. You're still you. Okay? You're still you. And I won't forget it. I won't forget that. Never. go take a shower, and then in a moment we'll head off for that walk, okay? I'll see you in a sec. Whew. Oh, fuck me, that was tiring. I did, I did enjoy it though. I think, uh, I think the, um, it tends to be a pretty good idea to go for a nice walk, you know, even if you're sort of, even if you feel as though you might be a little tired by the end of it. It tends to be a good idea, you know. Oh, I'm a good kisser, am I? Good. I'm glad you're finally able to admit it. I think you're a pretty good kisser, too. I was waiting for you to join me in the shower, you just... I don't know, maybe you maybe you got a little nervous. Hmm. I should, maybe, perhaps I should apologize. Perhaps I should apologize. Maybe... Well... Maybe it was because I've been so vulnerable lately, you didn't really want to intrude during my private time, perhaps? Sort of leave me to leave me some space. No, I understand. But I promise you, I don't think that any space that I have is ever. Well, I don't think it's ever less of my own if you're in it. It always feels pretty nice to just, even if I do need space. 
Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Although last time we showered together, I, I did really enjoy putting the shampoo on you and just kind of doting on you for a little bit. Maybe you can dote on me next time. You know, after I've been feeling all sad, maybe I need a little bit of a little bit of warmth, you know, a little bit of care taken. Well, yeah, I mean, you and I, we've been we've been seeing each other pretty much every day for a week. And I was surprised it took as long as it did. I'd rather you not try and act like a doctor around me, considering your experience with with doctors. I think uh, it might be best if uh, if we just stick to stick to being traditionally together rather than anything like that. Although, hmm, it's not that I'm it's not that I'm against role playing. Perhaps we can try that eventually. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. No, 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 it's okay. I didn't mean to embarrass you. Shh. Shh. I think... It's the... I think to an extent, it's the... Fact that... When you're in a park, anyone could walk by at any moment, but I think that the nicest part is that a park bench is just far, is just about far enough away that well, if someone did walk by, it wouldn't really matter, you know? Let's stay here for a little bit. I like the weather. It's really warm and... I love your outfit as well. We've got a little, we've got a, uh, a little while before the night market opens, so... And it's also a, it's a fair distance walk away even still, so... Might as well just spend a little while. Mm-hmm. Get, get, get. Come here, come here, get close to me. There you go. Let me hold you for a little while. Let me just hold you for a little while. You really are all I need. Hmm. All I've ever wanted. I'm surprised. Whenever I think about it, I am surprised. Surprised that all of those strange men you ran into in the past, they asked so much of you. Then <laughs> whether or not you enjoyed it, you have to admit it must have been fairly exhausting to get slapped around that much, surely. Come here. 
Rest that head on my shoulder and let me talk to you, okay? Let me stroke that head, okay? You're mine, all right? same way, just as much in total equality that I myself am yours, okay? I'm all yours and I'm no one else's, okay? But don't forget that that means you're mine and no one else's either, you understand? That's my sweet gentle thing. There you go. Gentle, sweet, sweet thing. I will. <laughs> I will. I'll prove it to you later, okay? I'll prove it to you as best I can. It's not like I'll be able to hold out for an entire week without you. I need something to remember you by. Of course it is. What, are you embarrassed? <laughs> Any passers-by, all they're going to see is two lovebirds having a little cuddle and a kiss in the corner of the park. I promise you I'm being just quiet enough that they can't hear what I'm, doing, what I'm telling you. Okay? Don't worry, sweet thing. It's okay. Don't be embarrassed to be seen around me. Don't feel like you need to fill in some kind of a... What is it? That you need to blend in. No one's upset to see us together. I guarantee you they're very, very, very jealous. And I think there's something nice to that. I think there's something quite nice to that. So let's let them be jealous, all right? Let's let them. Good. I should hope you're not embarrassed to be seen with me. I should hope not. You're very nice to kiss. Very nice indeed. <laughs> I really miss this. I miss this so badly. I really did. Oh, if you want to hit me with an attitude, all right, I will kiss you more then. Hmm. <laughs>
that's my sweet thing. Flattery will get you everywhere. We've only known each other for a week. Hmm. Well, you say you learned how to get good at kissing because of me, but to be honest, I thought you were really good last time as well. You shouldn't run yourself down. You're very good at it. Very, very good. Why do you think I keep coming back to you? I just can't help it. I really can't. Ah, oh, that's my sweet thing. Oh, but I don't want to touch grass right now. I want to touch you. <laughs> I don't want to breathe fresh air at the moment. I want to breathe yours. I'll be, I'll be touching plenty of grass next week. isn't all I'm good for. If you're alright with it, I would like to walk away with a little more than just a date, but that would, of course, be up to you, my darling. Okay, okay, that sounds good. Um, why don't we... <laughs> why don't we just cuddle a little more? How's that sound? Okay? I'm having a good time. 
It feels oddly private, and yet very unprivate at the same time. That's a little exciting, don't you agree? for every minute we'll be apart. Now that... Hmm. I'd have to get my calculator out for that. I'd have to get my calculator out. Not just... <laughs> yeah, we can just... Hope. I'll, I'll, I'll try and stretch them out over the course of the date, okay? And maybe tomorrow morning before I leave. And we'll include all of the kissing we'll have tonight. Okay? <sighs> I'm gonna miss you too. Sweet baby, I'm gonna miss you too so much. Don't. So much. So, so much. figured you for offer as one for mental maths, but well, whether it's right or wrong, I guess we can roll with it. <laughs> oh, now that is... that is a good idea. 522 kisses total. Hmm. Hmm. If I could receive a little mark from you, but I don't know. I don't really. I don't know if I'm really ready to show you off that much. Maybe we can leave it somewhere a little more private. someone so... what's the word? For someone so... devious. And someone who's gotten themselves into so much trouble. You're awfully... what's the word? Well... You're easily surprised. I want my back. How did you know I was into that? <laughs> Probably mentioned it a while ago. Maybe this is a little too much for public, but, um... I'm... <laughs> I'm not super worried about it. I'm super worried about it at all. A 
but you'd like one. Hmm. Are you sure you wouldn't rather save it for later? Because I don't know. Before I leave, I'd like to get a lot of my... A lot of my frustration out. It might be nice to... Well, if I can leave a mark on you then... I'd rather... Maybe if I go for your neck. Let's keep it at just one. Okay? Alright, alright. A little bit of both. People are gonna look at me like I'm a little bit. Uh, people are gonna look at us like we're a, like we're a bit of a freak, but uh, I think that's fine. Oh, of course. Hey, come here, come here. Sorry, I got a little hot and heavy there. Oh yes, later, later. Let's just spend a few more minutes together, and then we'll move on. Okay. You got a little too excited there, I've got to save that for later, okay? Enjoy this part of town. 
You might not be able to hear it at the moment, but we're literally surrounded by people. Little stalls, all sorts of places where anything could be going on, anything could be sold. And you and I are just gonna hold hands and walk around for a little bit. Just for a little bit, okay? teeth the mark on your neck, just know that you did that to yourself. <laughs> but of course, if it does make you a little embarrassed, then you, I can probably go and find you a scarf to put on somewhere around here. What is this obsession you're on with caviar pizza? You begged for it last time, and I'm not even sure that exists, does it? To be honest, even after I've gotten used to you, and even after I've come all this way, and gotten so used to having you in my arms, I still think I would need a break from you if you decided to get that. I couldn't be around you, to be honest. The smell would be too much. <laughs> Hot pot would be nice too. Mm -hmm. Perhaps we'll just grab a drink and relax for a while. Anything you're worried about at all? Anything at all? We'll probably have a little bit of time before we find something. I'm getting a bit of a nervous uh, energy from you today. Is everything alright? Are you sure? No, no, I'm not cold. You'd be welcome to borrow my coat if you'd like. This is sort of a, it's a more summery evening, so I wouldn't worry about it. Hey, don't worry about it. 
Ferguson. Even if those guys show back up, maybe the pair of them are looking for you right now. The doctor and the officer, maybe they are. But what'll they do if they find you? Hmm? You've got me. If they come up, and if they decide to give you any trouble, I will just hold your hand as tight as I can. And I'll look at them, and I will tell them to fuck off. Okay? <laughs> That's all we need to do. They might be stronger than me, but... Well, two of them combined, possibly. Maybe. But, I don't know. I reckon maybe the right thing to do... Hmm... you like my smell, so, yeah, I think that'd be nice. Well, the obvious fear, and, well, I'm, I'm a little scared, too. I know what you, I know what you mean when you say that distance makes the heart grow cold. But it's only a week. It's only a week. I should like to think that you aren't disloyal enough. That after just one week apart, that you'd already lose interest in me. I certainly won't be losing interest in you. makes the heart grow colder? Maybe, but absence also makes the heart grow fonder. Whenever I'm away, whenever I have a free moment, my mind will come back to you. Whenever I have time to marinate and wonder rather be doing right now, my mind will come back to you. And I should pray, and I should hope, that perhaps when you feel lonely, perhaps when you feel a little upset, or when you're without something to distract you, that your mind will drift. We'll text, of course. I'll have a chance to keep in contact with you, and then... When I get back, well, we'll have all these ideas about things we can do together. Okay? The greatest form of love is patience. And I'll patiently wait.
That's my sweet thing. Don't worry, baby. I'll be there for you when you get back. Or rather, I hope that you're there for me when I get back. <laughs> Good. Good. Thank you. Away with words, you say. Thank you. I'm not a professor, nor am I a writer of any kind. I'm just me. <laughs> I have never told you what I do for a living, though, have I? Maybe I'll tell you later. You might find it a little hard to believe. Don't worry about me. definitely notice that there's something a little peculiar about me. Who else has hair like this and eyes like these? Well, hmm. there's definitely more to me than meets the eye. there's more to you than meets the eye as well. Alright then. Try me. If you tell me who you are, why you keep getting into trouble, and all of that, every part of it, every little bit of it, then sure, I'll tell you who I am. Your hand clasped tightly inside of mine.
You're a... Hang on a minute. You're a kindred, you say? That's a bizarre coincidence. Hmm. Tell me, um... Would you perhaps... Would you like to head home soon? We can stay out a little longer if you'd like. That was just quite a... Quite interesting development. <laughs> You'd like to go home? Sure. Let's go for a walk. Or... Hmm. It is getting late. Uh, maybe we can grab an Uber or something. Maybe we can take the train. Yeah. Let's do that. Alright. said that you were kindred. What did that mean? Be honest. No matter what you say, I will never think of you differently. You're my baby and I won't look at you any differently. I just have to know. So you knew all this time, and you were just teasing me, weren't you? You knew I wasn't human, you knew I was a demon, and that my name was Vox Akuma. And you've been one of the people watching me online this whole time. Now that's really embarrassing. <laughs> oh, what a beautiful coincidence. Hey, come here. you asked me to. <laughs> well, it doesn't matter. I trust you. Okay? It's even more sexy now that I think about it, isn't it? You and me doors. Hmm. Only
only me and only you. That is quite sweet, isn't it? Come in, okay? Let me hold you. Let me hold you. Mm. I forgive you, okay? For not telling me. I forgive you. Kindred. Is that what you'd like me to call you? Kindred. My sweet, beautiful, loyal kindred. All wrapped up in my arms. Mm. That's very sweet. Hmm. Ah, clever, clever. All right. So, tell me, now that I've got you all to myself, no people around, no one in the park, no one, well, no one at the night market, what would you like to do? I've got some ideas, but it's up to you. Hmm. Uh-huh. I'd like that. Come here, come here. I sit on my lap.
Oh, of course you can. Hey. My shirt's on the on the sofa beside you. You're welcome to change into it, but I don't really want to let you move, so just you're still right here. It doesn't bother me. Don't worry about it. I could do anything I want. Uh, the world is full of hope, after all. <laughs> Can't even pull those lines cleverly anymore. You know where they're from. Sure, it looks good on you. You can keep it while I'm gone. Keep this in my jacket so that you can remember me, okay? While you're while I'm away, I'd I'd like it if you could keep that on, or at least have it around. You know what? Don't wear it. Just have it nearby, so that it doesn't get. Just so that it stays good doesn't get all gross. And then, if ever you miss me, you can have it nearby. You can hold it close. And then, over time, it'll start reminding you over and over and over again of how much you'd, you wish that I was here. Hmm? I can't imagine love would grow cold in that kind of an environment. You understand? Bracelet? No. This thing is expensive. And I like it. I think it goes good on my wrist. But maybe if I got rid of it, it might finally encourage me to get a really nice watch. Hmm. Huh. What? I never said I wouldn't. You were sat on my lap while you changed. It's not like I can... What, do you want me to just shut my eyes? If you keep acting as boring as, boring as that, I might have fallen asleep if I shut my eyes. <laughs> oh, I'm just teasing, I'm just teasing. I'm only teasing, it's okay. No, no, I don't eat people. I'd eat you. I'd eat you a bunch of times. You look tasty. <laughs> I think that's the hallmark of, a, of the good start of a relationship. Is if you can use terrible pickup lines like that and they actually work. <laughs> I like yours too. I think they're funny. I think it's part of why I fell in love with you. You've got a great sense of humor. I look good in this outfit, thank you. Wouldn't I look better out of it? Hmm. Maybe that's not what you're in the mood for tonight. Don't put yourself under too much pressure, babe. All this depends on what you want. It's not about me, okay? You're the one whose boyfriend is gonna go on a flight somewhere else and you won't see him for a whole week. I'm sorry about that. Tonight is about you. And I want to get this right. Okay? I think there's room for both, but...
Would you prefer that I stayed like this and maybe until later all we did was kiss and cuddle and hold one another and then well maybe we could do something else later it's up to you I'd like to keep you on my lap though it feels very very good <laughs> Of course this shirt's made of boyfriend material. You agreed to go out with me on day one. I don't want to say you were desperate, but maybe you just really, really liked me specifically, which I quite like. <laughs> Oh, you are desperate? Good. Don't get desperate for anyone else while I'm away. I'll be very disappointed. You wouldn't want that. But of course, don't forget that I'm yours as well. Never forget that. Okay? Never forget that. I'm excited. thinking about later on. So you've brought up a few times the whole bite mark thing. You really enjoyed that earlier, didn't you? Hmm, okay, okay, tell me, I'm happy to give you one elsewhere a little bit later, why don't, hmm, hmm, to, I'll give you a choice, okay? And there'll be room for both later. Either I'll put more on your neck. Maybe turn it into a necklace. And I trust you to cover that up when you're in public. <laughs> Unless you want to show it off. Or 
Perhaps you can give me one on my chest. First of all, let me do this to you. I get to mark yours too. Take your shirt off. Do it. good on you. It's like, uh, it's like a long necklace. Goes all the way down from your neck down to, down to your chest. Hmm. It looks very good on you. Very good indeed. Go 
Go ahead, give it a try. Just lean down and try and put one on me. <laughs> Damn, you play hard, fuck. That was nice. One more, maybe. One more. <laughs> now, fuck, you play hard. <laughs> oh, that was good. Hey. Let me kiss you again. That was so good. see it in the mirror every time I take a shower or every time I get up in the morning. I'll get up no matter how far away I am from you. I'll see those marks and I'll think about how good it felt when you put those on me. And I'll remember exactly what I'm coming up to. Mm-hmm. capable of feeling things too. I'll tell you what. Try scratching my back. You're still sat on my lap, right? Lean forward, lean forward. Let me hold you close to me. And then... some scratches on my back, and if you're good, and if it affects me, I'll bury my head in your neck and I might give you just one more. How about that? That's some fun? Oh, you are good at that. 
didn't underestimate you. Oh, it is quite sensitive, yes. Oh God, you're so easy. Hmm. I loved easing you a little bit. You get blushy so easily and I say one or two different things and they just get inside your head so easily. <laughs> Alright, I'll try scratching yours. yourself so much credit. Don't give yourself so much credit. I wouldn't dare give you that satisfaction. You'd really like it if that made me a bottom, wouldn't you? I'd give you a little laugh, wouldn't you? <laughs> I just really like it when you fight back a bit. I like it when it's a bit more of a challenge. You would like that, wouldn't you? Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> oh, you sweet thing. It's okay. I'm sorry to let you down. But you sat on my lap doing exactly what I tell you to. It's about as close to the top of me as you will forget. So keep trying to climb that mountain. I'll keep dragging you down. Those marks I left are they a bit sore? Hey, let me kiss them for you, don't worry. Oh, you do? Oh, you do? Ways of making me submit, eh? Oh, you're a feisty one today. <laughs> yeah, give it a try. Give it a try. It's, I have to say, it's almost a more fun to watch you labor under the delusion that you can get me to do anything at all. It is quite sweet of you. Very, very sweet. I'm starting to get the feeling that you and I might 
might be about to go and have some fun, and I'd like to remind you, I've got no problems acting like those other men and slapping the shit out of you if you decide to test me. Do you understand? Oh, don't worry, don't worry. I won't do anything if you don't ask for it, okay? Shh, it's okay. I like messing around with you, but not nearly as much as I enjoy reminding you that everything's going to be okay, okay? Mm -hmm. Ah, yeah. For old time's sake. For old time's sake, cute. Lie down. Rest your head on my chest, baby, and we'll just relax for a while. quick because I'm happy. Yeah, I will miss you. Of course I will. Of course I'll miss you. Of course I'll miss you.
just yet. Alright. Just lie with me, baby. It's okay. Just lie with me. It's okay. Recently I started listening to this song. It it speaks to me a little because I think it's about not over worrying about things. is what I need. And it's all I've ever wanted. sing for you a little more, but, uh, I don't think my voice is really cooperating today. I feel a little sleepy, and maybe I don't want to. Yeah, I do. I'm glad you know the song. It was a shame the keyboard player passed away recently. It was only right as I learned about them. It's a little sad, but I guess it just reminds you to live life as fully as you can, and I never feel fuller than when I'm lying here holding you. That's right, baby, that's right, it is called by your name. Your favorite song? Wow. 
It's from my favorite film. <laughs> song from that film. The one at the end. I'm not sure if I want to hum that one because it'll make me sad. That's right. you're feeling emotional and you're missing me listen to that song because I promise that whenever I miss you I'll probably listen to it as well We had well. We'd better head to the station fairly soon. Let's try and get a little bit of sleep, and then tomorrow morning we'll walk away together. Okay. Look at me. Okay. I know that you have a tendency to get into trouble, to get into scrapes. And I know it's only because you have a big heart full of this desire for adventure and full of love and passion. But please, you have something more to protect now. You have something more to look after now, okay? Please, my sweetest thing, my sweet baby, please don't let me down, okay? Please don't let me down. I'll keep an eye on you. And I leave where I left it when I get back, including my PS5. You can use it, but you can't take it. <laughs> Love is strong, but it's not that strong. <laughs> okay, baby, just lie with me. And let's get some sleep, shall we? you plenty of kisses when we go to the airport tomorrow morning. Before we sleep, here you go.
There you are, baby. Now come and lie with me. Slept well. Here we are. Uh, my flight leaves pretty soon, so uh, I'm gonna have to go check in, and then, well, when I do, I, that'll be that'll be it. So, uh, I just don't want you to worry about me too much, okay? Please don't worry so much. It'll just be a little while longer. And it'll probably feel like it takes longer than it should. But I promise you, when I get when I get back, it will have felt like a lot longer. <laughs> I'll miss you, all right? And I know it might be really, really difficult for you to get on without me, but you are so much, and I mean this, you are so much stronger and more dependable and more you're more of everything regardless completely regardless of whether I am there or not okay your life is wonderful it's full and there is so much purpose waiting for you whether I am in it or not Okay? So while I'm gone, I don't want you to spend the whole week missing me. I want you to spend it making me proud. Okay? Because there's nothing, and I mean truly nothing, that I would miss more than someone whose life would live and survive whether or not I was in it. Do you understand? I know you'll miss me. I'll miss you too. And I think, no matter how much you say you miss me, I promise you that I will miss you more. I will. That's just a, it's just a fact, and... Well, I'll try not to make this too sentimental because I'm not going forever. It'll only be a week, okay? Just one week and then when I get back, I'll have a whole new place to move into and, well, I say that, I mean, we'll have a whole new place to move into if you'd like to. More than enough space for the pair of us. You can spend as many times as you want, as much time as you'd like, spending days lazing on the couch with me, heading around the city and exploring. As long as, now that I've learned, <laughs> as long as when I'm live, you keep the noise down a little. Thank you, from the bottom of my heart. I'm gonna miss you so much. So, the last thing that I would want would be for you to treat this like something sad, because it's a chance for you to prove to me that you're as strong as I think you are. I want you to take care of yourself. I want you to look after the other people in your life that you know. I want you to be a good leader. I want you to be strong and wise. And prove to me why I'm so proud of you. 
I love you, Kindred. And I won't be gone for long. I think that's my time. I'll have to see you later. Don't miss me too much. Right, yes. The gate's open. I, I have to go. Don't run after me. And remember that I'll be here before you know it. Okay? Take care of yourself. And remember that above all else, like I said, Kindred, I love you very, very, very much. And I'm convinced that I always will.